Hevenu shalom alechem. In the native language of my Lord and Savior Yahshua HaMashiach, the one in English we call Jesus Christ. The world sleeps just like sheep, peaceful in a pillow padded with lies. I'm praying daily, but the world's got even intellectual thinkers mesmerized. My people starve for revival, but in God's words they stray away instead of seek. In about four seconds, by the grace of God, I will begin to teach. You are now watching The Conservative Racer. Remember, the race is not over until Christ returns. Proverbs 13.5 A righteous man hateth lying, but a wicked man is loathsome and cometh to shame. Simply put, everything is either lie or truth, and that which you fill in your head will shape your beliefs and ultimately govern the path you have in this world. And rooting yourself in the word of God, I believe is key, especially in these times of misleading uncertainty. In these times of uncertainty. During this time of great uncertainty. During these uncertain times. During these uncertain times. In uncertain times. In uncertain times. Uncertain times. Unprecedented times. Unprecedented times. Unprecedented times. This unprecedented moment in our history. It's time of social distancing. While things have slowed down. As we turn more inside. While the doors may be closed. While the distance between us has gotten bigger. The more we stay apart. We still find ways to stay close. Even when we're apart. Even if we can't stand closer than six feet. We can all stay connected to work, school, and most importantly, to each other. There's still ways to touch each other. All without leaving the comfort and safety of your home. Without leaving the safety of your home. From home. From home. Your home. At home. 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 Big home. development in the Jesse Smollett investigation. The Buick and GMC are here to help. Let's entitle this Common Sense versus the Television. Television, a communication tool for the telling of visions from the mind of the one behind the script. Programming minds and laying down righteous contradictory subject matter while creating a new type of virtual drug addict. Ask yourself this as I go down the list. How many of these catchy buzz phrases have you become indoctrinated with? When we talk about the virus, all the fear and all the pressure, the TV chimes right in, reminding you we're all in this together. And what's the deal with our school system? The old school books are collecting dust on the shelf. Meanwhile, new age teachers are telling our children to be their authentic self. I understand there's always been a little confusion, but we're leading our kids astray. As soon as I turn my back, I hear the TV telling kids, God made me this way. Well, I'm hurt from the media lies. And I can't believe their audacity. Thank God it's not a real pain because I hear the hospitals are at their full capacity. Listen, the thing I'm trying to stress to you, and I'm gonna make myself blunt so we're clear. Wake up, everything you see in the media is not always what it appears. Tell a vision program. I can't make this any more logical. Can't you see television programming is even subliminal? What's that phrase Disney likes to say? It's simply magical. So as I get ready to close out, let me ask you, what's your favorite television program? And people, I'm not saying I don't watch television, but understand this, it's social engineering and it's programming you. And also, let me say, I believe that the more rooted you are in the Word of God, the more ability you'll have to break out of this spell. And it begins by just being aware. So get familiar. Antonio's Jessica Headley. And I'm Ryan Wolf. Our, our greatest, greatest responsibility, responsibility is, is to, to serve, serve our, our Treasure Valley communities. The El Paso Las Cruces communities. Eastern Iowa communities. Mid-Michigan communities. We are extremely proud of the quality, balanced journalism that CBS4 News produces.
But we are concerned about trouble and trying to be responsible, one sided news stories playing in our country. In fact, first, the sharing of biased and false, false news has become, become all too common on, on social, social media. media. More alarming, some media outlets publish and publish these stories simply aren't true without checking facts first. Unfortunately, some members of the media use their platforms to push their own personal bias and agenda to control exactly what people think. And this is extremely dangerous. To our, our democracy. democracy. This is extremely dangerous to our democracy. This is extremely dangerous to our democracy. This is extremely dangerous to our democracy. This is extremely da dangerous to our democracy. This is extremely dangerous, dangerous to our democracy. Dangerous. Extremely dangerous. Our democracy. Extremely dangerous to our democracy. <laughs>